What's up? Saturday, July 14th, 2012. About to go digging. It's around 7 a.m. right now. But uh, later today in the afternoon, I'm going to hit up this event. The grand opening of a store called Mount Analog, which is a new record store in the L.A. area located in Highland Park. Um, I just kind of stumbled across this earlier this week. I don't know too much about the store or what it's going to be like, but supposedly a lot of DJs are going to be performing there. I'm going to try to be there as soon as they open at 12 p.m., hit the fresh stock um, in the store and see what else is there. So we'll take a little bit of footage of that and then, uh, yeah. Here's a little footage to kill time. Um, I'm here at Amoeba. I usually finish digging at my Hollywood spot around 10-ish. So I'll stay there for a couple hours. Um, picked up around 40 records today. Um, today was his dollar day sale, so everything was a dollar. Pretty good. A lot of stuff I'm planning on reselling. Uh, I've made a commitment to sell at the Buena Parks record show at the end of this month on the 29th, I think. So, if you're in the LA or Orange County area, I'll be there. Probably the youngest guy selling my records. Um, so yeah, I usually just end up sitting outside Amoeba because it's sort of a given that I have to make a stop here. So, it's about 10.17 right now, so stay put for another 15 minutes and then head inside and then after that to Mount Analog the grand opening for that so take footage of that later All right, quick closing video. Just show you guys what I got at Mount Analog today. Um, as well as some basic feedback. I uh, got there at 12 o'clock when it was supposed to start, <clears throat> but for some reason they had us waiting outside for almost half an hour, despite people, maybe like friends of staff or something inside, like just digging in front of our faces while the, the gates were closed. So it was a little irritating, but uh, when they finally got the doors open, a lot of people flooded in. Um, I hit whatever sections I could. Um, and I'm sure there's some other people that, that got some of the good stuff. But in terms of the selection of what they have, I found that it was more focused on obscure, like psychedelic, you know, kraut rock, that type of stuff. Um, the soul and funk section was very small. Jazz section was very small hip-hop section is very small. I'm talking like a quarter of a bin, so really not focused on that, so I don't know how much I'll personally be going back there since those are the genres I'm pretty much looking for, but um, pretty good selection. A lot of reissues there of, you know, the very obscure psych stuff and um, around six, six bins full of cheaper records, like at a dollar two or three dollars or five um it's pretty good it got really hot inside so um i guess maybe just because a lot of people showed up at once it uh it was not too bad and then they had a couple of listening stations also so um i'll put the information down below in case you guys are in the, in the la area and want to check it out overall it's a pretty good place to check out um if you're into you know psychedelic music and stuff like that uh, but here's what I picked up I'll probably mention these again when I do my crate dig video uh, so this is Nolan something forgot his last name 
two bucks. Archie Shep on Impulse, dollar for that. <clears throat> Wayne Shorter, Supernova, one dollar. Uh, Master Ace, Slaughterhouse, six dollars for this, which is pretty good in my opinion. Uh, I didn't really do the research to see if it's completely an original pressing, but regardless, that's another one of the classic albums that I haven't picked up yet, so I've got that. <clears throat> Pharaoh Sanders, Jewels of Thought, and Mulatto of Ethiopia, reissue of this. I always hear a lot about this album, how it's really good, and uh, thought I would pick up the reissue, eight bucks for that. So, um, pretty good turnout. I also got a lot of other stuff today, which will be discussed at the Crate Dig video at the end of the month. So. Uh, Mount Analog in Highland Park, generally favorable review for me, so that's all. Thanks for watching. Peace.